Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the first 20 minutes of Lords of Solgrund, a unique city building and real time strategy game developed by Luminous Games. This is very much like Knights and Merchants, a legendary strategy game originally released in, I think, 1998. I played this a lot when I was younger, which sadly reminds me of how old I'm getting. Before I go any further, please consider liking and subscribing. It counts as your good deed of the day. In this video, I will give you an overview of the game while playing the first 20 minutes and share my first impressions at the end. Don't worry, I won't talk for 20 minutes. This will only take a few minutes of your time, but I'll keep the footage running for those who are interested. Lords of Solgrund is a city-building game with real-time strategy content. You are placed in the role of the Lord of a city and are responsible for making it a thriving city. You do this by building land plots for farms, roads, barracks, decorations, houses, inns and many other buildings. When you place those, your citizens will start building the structures, assuming you have the needed materials, of course. That's where the fun of this game comes from. The city building aspect of the game requires careful planning and efficient resource management. Resources such as wood, stone and food must be gathered and allocated wisely. You'll need to balance expansion with sustainability, ensuring that your settlement can withstand seasonal changes and unexpected challenges. The game offers a detailed approach to settlement development, including diverse building options and intricate economic systems. Buildings can be upgraded to improve their efficiency and capacity, and the strategic placement of structures can significantly impact your settlement's productivity. On top of that, you can also use functions like trade and diplomacy to further improve your city and impact the results of the match. In addition to city building, Lords of Solgrund features tactical real-time combat. You will need to defend your settlement from various threats, including bandits and rival lords. The combat system allows for various units and formations with terrain and weather influencing the outcome of battles. I haven't actively tried this part yet, so I cannot say if it's fun or not. But honestly, that matters less to me. I never played knights and merchants for that. I played it for optimising my city. My first impression of this game is that it's knights and merchants, but with way more buildings and options to further grow your city. I'm really happy that there is a more hardcore game like this. A lot of the other options seem like cosy city builders, and even though I get the appeal, those are just not for me. I want the time pressure of potentially seeing all my citizens die if I don't make enough bread. I'm very excited to dive back into this. That's your overview of Lords of Solgrund. If you found this information helpful, please like and subscribe for more updates. Please let me know in the comments if you are planning to play this one.